It's going to be the hottest college basketball game in Hampton Roads this year. The Lady Monarchs are back in the Chartwell Arena. It's going to be rocking tomorrow night. I'm Bruce Rader. It will be number one Rice against number two Old Dominion tomorrow night in the Conference USA Game of the Year. Two big win streaks on the line, and Brian Parsons is here with us tonight with a preview. Brian. What a difference a couple of years make. In Nikki McRae's first season as head coach of the Old Dominion women's basketball team, the Lady Monarchs won eight games. In year two, 21 games. And in year three, ODU is 10 and one in conference play, 20 and three overall. It has a nine game winning streak and has won 13 in a row at home. Tomorrow night, a showdown with first place Rice, which has won 30 conference games in a row. That's where we want to get one day. You know, we want to be in a position to where, you know, we're on a streak. You know, that's what, you know, Lady Monarch basketball did, you know, back in the day. And um, we just, we're not there yet. Under former coach Wendy Larry, the Lady Monarchs went to 18 consecutive NCAA tournaments, including a Final Four run. ODU has not been to the big dance in 12 years, and a win over Rice would help the Monarchs' chances of getting a return bid. But while Coach McCray knows tomorrow's game is a big one, it's still just another game on the schedule. It's not like it's the national championship game, but it is a game that, you know, we have to play well in order to win, but we got to stay true to form and who we are. One tall challenge tomorrow night for ODU will be defending Rice's Nancy Mulkey, who stands six foot nine. For us, we got to get up in transition. You know that, and you got to be physical with her um, without fouling. Um, but she's such a huge presence on both ends of the floor. You know that's the reason why they've they're they're on a 30 game win streak is because you have a six nine kid, you know, in the paint that alters shots um, that can score right over you. ESPN's Bracketology has ODU as one of the last four teams to make the NCAA tournament. But Coach McCray cautions, not so fast, everybody. I don't look at that. I don't, I don't want our team looking at those things just because we're not there yet. I mean, we still got seven games left to decide if we're going to even get a bye. You know, we just take one game at a time. And that next game is quite possibly the biggest in a decade for Old Dominion. In Norfolk, Brian Parsons for the Sports Wrap.